1958, a man named William Marion Branham preached a message entitled, The Serpent Seed. Since then, many scholars scoffed and ridiculed him and said that he was a false prophet and that he went away from the truth. A nice fellow but he fell off the turnip truck, they would say. Well, over 60 years have passed and science has now discovered that the idea has merit. If you're new to the idea of the serpent seed, I'll explain. Eve had sex with an upright, and she was impregnated by him. She went back to Adam, had sex and was impregnated by him too. They covered their parts as if to hide the sin. If the sin were due to eating fruit, they would have covered their mouths. Eve said to God, the serpent beguiled me, and I did eat. Beguiled means seduce and eat means partake of. God cursed the upright and he became a serpent. God cursed the womb of the woman and cursed the ground for man's sake. Eve had twins, Cain and Abel. Same mother but two different fathers. Eve had a son Cain, then right away had another son, Abel. Abel became a shepherd where Cain became a tiller of the ground. Both men made an offering to God, Abel offered the blood offering where Cain offered the best from his farm. God accepted the blood offering but did not accept Cain's, however, he did say to Cain, if you do the same as your brother, your offering will be accepted. Instead, Cain killed his brother. A child takes on the characteristics of its father, since Adam was the first man, or a son of God, he shows the same characteristics of him. Kind. Loving. Patience, etc. Abel was like his father before him, Adam. Cain on the other hand, was nothing like Adam. Cain was a liar and a murderer right from the start, just like his father. Just like the father of lies. Jesus said, you can judge a tree by its fruit. Now, take a look at these videos. In the US now, a woman has given birth to twins who have different fathers. Our correspondent Mike Haymore joins us now to explain this one. Mike, good morning. This must be one in a million. It is literally one in a million, Anne, and I'll try to explain. It's probably another good reason not to cheat on your father, on your, on your partner. Uh, as d difficult as it is to understand, Maya Washington got pregnant to two different men at the same time. She had an affair on her partner, James. James fathered one child and another unknown man fathered uh, the second unnamed man. Uh, imagine uh, being party to the conversation when it was explained to James what had gone on. It became obvious after the two boys, uh, Jordan and Justin, look different. They are now 11 months old. The DNA test confirmed that they had two different fathers. Doctors say it is rare, but it is possible that the woman produces two eggs and they are fertilized by different sperm in a very short period of time. Now, Maya spoke out to warn others. James says he will father both children as his own. Out of all people in America, out of all the people in the world, it had to happen to me, but I'm very shocked. And it's a day by day thing. As you know, it's going to take time to build up trust between us like we, you know, had. Yeah. Now, Maya says uh, to people, do not judge her. And by the way, Anne, they are going to expand their family. Maya is pregnant with their third child, and we're told that James is the father. Okay. Mike, Anne, we're in the U.S. Good to talk to you, Mike.